I've made it. I'm here in San Francisco and I'm going to the Japanese gardens. I'm really excited. I think they have like a tea room there and I've been to Japan and I love Japan so I'm really stoked to bring back some fond memories of one of my favorite countries. Look at the Japanese tea garden. It's so cute. I love the little houses. I don't know if you could see the house, but that's cute. I love how Japanese people keep everything so clean and quaint. It's really awesome. Let's go explore. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love it. So oh, nice. which is tea from Kyoto, which is roasted in a pot over charcoal. Interesting. Smoky flavor. Hi, squirrel. Hey. Hey, little squirrel. Add matcha to my How they do it in Japan. I stayed in a temple when I was in Japan and they put it in a big bowl. This is kind of like coffee and uh, it's like a very serious tea in Japan is like a very serious thing. They have tea ceremonies. It's basically when they serve you tea, there are different ways of doing it. They are basically honoring you. Then they have this rice cake. Ooh, it smells really mushy and good. Okay, let's try this. Mm. Very bitter. That's why I have this. Mm. With bean paste. All over Japan. Every hotel I went to, they had the bean paste. But this is nice because it's really mushy. And um, in Japan, most of them are wrapped up, so it's really good. Okay, let's try the other one. Oh, I like these little forks. It's like a baby fork. Let's try this. Ooh, it's so, it's so floofy. Mmm. It's like nutty. It's really that is called mm. So, these ones, that is called Gwari Bee Mochi. It kind of looks like mochi. And this little bean paste thing is Wakashi. Wakashi. Mmm. Good stuff. Breathe out. Hmm, such a beautiful tree. I don't know what it is, but it looks nice. There's a single fishy. Any of you fish are watching out there? Looks like he's looking for a mate, or she's looking for a mate. Oh! Possibly. So beautiful.
Zen Gardens came over from China to, to Japan, and then it came over to the United States later on. And they made these Zen Gardens to aid the monks in their search for enlightenment. It's meant to symbolize the mountain and the general terrain of their home. The Children of Japan, the school of children in Japan, saved up their money and donated this lantern as a gift to the United States commemorating the peace treaty. So nice. These are Japanese temples or shrines. Um, they come from the Indian way stupa, which is basically a little house to commemorate a king or special birthday.